Play by play man, John Abbott of the Toronto Marlies. One of the last times the Marlies and Rochester Americans met, they went to overtime. A bit of a story happened in behind the net. I remember your call. Uh, you want to walk us through that? <laughs> yes, uh, Nazem Kadri went into the boards. I think it was Morrison that he got tangled up with. And uh, right behind David Leggio. Leggio, the goaltender for the Americans, decided that at that point in time in the game, that once the two were separated, he would skate over and uh, decide to chirp Nas and uh, let him have it. And he went, not only did he skate over, he sort of followed him uh, to between the circles until the, the referees sort of broke everything up. So he went after him to make sure he had a piece of his mind. And I think there was a minute 22 left or something and a tied hockey game and uh, looking like it was going to head to overtime. And I just thought that was the, should be the furthest thing from uh, his mind is what he's going to say to Nazem Kadri in terms of chirping at the end of the game. And as it would turn out, uh, you know, the Marlies would go on and win in overtime and, and Leggio would be twice as mad and, and Nas would have the, the last laugh both in the game and in the next game. So it was a pretty pretty funny circumstance uh, and interesting being an outsider because uh, when the games get that heated, you just never know what's going to happen. And for Leggio, it was uh, probably a, a moment to, to forget for him. And uh, before we wrap up, my favorite part was the call. You said, I'm not a goalie coach and I'm not a therapist. <laughs> Just a broadcaster, but I uh, was lending my two cents. We're paid to have an opinion, and mine was that uh, Leggio should probably uh, worry ab about other things that late in the game as opposed to, to talking to Nas, and I, I, I think Nas had the same opinion. <laughs>